People's Self-Defense Forces of Donbas reported that on the night Ukrainian military opened fire against the People's Self-Defense positions as many as seven times. During the night, the Ukrainian armed forces were shelling the positions of the Donetsk and Lugansk People's Republics. No less than seven times did the Ukrainian army use weapons, the headquarters of the Donetsk People's Republic said. In particular, Ukrainian soldiers fired at the Self-Defense Forces positions to the northwest of Donetsk and Gorlovka. No casualties have been reported. The DPR headquarters said that no retaliatory fire was opened. The Crimean naval base, a part of the Black Sea Fleet until 1996, is reconstructed fully, a representative of the Black Sea Fleet's headquarters told reporters on Sunday. The headquarters are in Sevastopol, where until March 19 were the headquarters of the Ukrainian Navy. The head is Captain Yuri Zemsky, who previously was commander of a Navy division in the Mediterranean Sea, the representative said. The new units have joined the group of forces to provide coverage from the Black Sea from enemy ships. Kiev's decision to cancel Ukraine's non-aligned status make Ukraine Russia's potential military adversary, Russian Prime Minister Dmitry Medvedev stated on his Facebook page. Ukrainian president has submitted a bill to a Verkhovna Rada canceling Ukraine's non-aligned status. Essentially, this is a bid to join NATO, which makes Ukraine Russia's potential military adversary, Medvedev posted on his Facebook Monday. We remember, last Thursday, Ukrainian President Petro Poroshenko submitted a draft law to the country's parliament introducing changes to the Ukraine's non non-alignment policies. Non-alignment has provided an efficient and punitive operation against people of Donbas, so Kyiv needs help of NATO immediate. Catalonia's High Court said Monday it is going to open an investigation into the alleged disobedience of regional president Artur Mas for holding a symbolic independence referendum in November in defiance of Madrid's opposition. The non-binding vote took place on November 9 and saw 2 million out of a possible 5.4 million Catalans take part. Some 80% voted for independence. The referendum was blocked by Spain's constitutional court, but Mas pressed ahead anyway and used volunteers instead of government officials to marshal the event. We thank our information partners for help with spreading this video news. Subscribe to our channel to receive up-to-date information on the situation in Ukraine and current geopolitical events in Europe.